Hello and welcome to The Real Unreal. This is the fourth episode of the Health and Damage series, where we will learn how to use the health component in a different actor, which will be an explosive barrel. Let's get started. Project Setup We will continue from where we left off in the previous video. Link in the description. Before creating the new actor, let's create a new material for our explosive barrel. Go to Level Prototyping, Materials, and duplicate the material named MI Solid Blue. Name it MI underscore metallic underscore red. Open it and let's do some changes. Change the base color to red. Enable metallic and set it to 1. Enable roughness and set it to 0 0.5. Save, and we're ready to continue. In the Health and Damage directory, create a new Blueprint class and select Actor as the parent class. Name it BP underscore Explosive Barrel. Open it and add the following components. One cylinder, which will be the mesh for our explosive barrel. Drag it and make it the root component. Change the material to the new metallic red and set simulate physics to true. Then add a radial force component. This one will emit an impulse when the barrel explodes. Set the radius to 500 and set impulse belt change to true. Last, add the health component. We will use the unheld depleted event to generate the explosion and destroy the barrel. Set max health to 30. And these are the three components we need to create an explosive barrel. Now, with the health component selected, go to the event sections and add the unheld depleted event. The first thing to do when the health of the barrel reaches zero is to execute the apply radial damage function. This function will apply damage to all the actors inside certain radius. Set base damage to 100 to make sure that the explosion will kill the character. Set origin to get actor location. Set damage radius to 500, which is the same value used for the radius of the radial force component. From the damage causer param, drag and search for reference to self. This will exclude the barrel actor from taking damage from this event. Last, set do fall damage to true. Now, let's add sound and visual effects for the explosion. For the visual effect, search for spawn emitter at location. Set emitter template to P explosion. Set location to get actor location once again. And in scale, set all the values to 3, so the explosion is 3 times bigger than normal. For the sound effect, search for play sound at location. Set sound to explosion cue. Set location to get actor location once again. Once the damage is applied and the effects are added, we just have to emit the impulse and destroy the actor to finish our explosive barrel. From the radial force component, search for fire impulse. This will emit an impulse with the parameters you configured in the component. And last, call destroy actor. Compile, save, and add this new actor to the level. I will add it just in front of the fire, so it's easy to push it to make it take some damage. Press play and push the barrel to the fire. You will see that after a delay, it explodes and kills our character. And that's it for the fourth episode of the Health and Damage series. I hope you like it. If so, I invite you to give it a like, subscribe to the channel and follow me on social networks. 
I'll be uploading Unreal Engine 5 tutorials frequently, and right now I'm working on an entire course for beginners. Thank you for joining and hope to see you in the next video.